guys, it's Mel here with Mel's Foxy Favorites, and I have an awesome trick to show you guys that is going to make your jewelry look amazing when you do your live videos. So I wanted to share it with you guys because I just learned it not very long ago, and it's awesome. So pretend that I'm doing a live jewelry show, okay? And all of us have these busts, don't we? Or a lot of us, okay? They are the black ones. They are the felt material. Um, a lot of the stuff sticks to that, and little white lint gets stuck to it. It just doesn't look that good. It kind of looks dirty. But the main problem with this is the fact that when you put the jewelry on it, it kind of makes it washed out. So it doesn't look as good as it could look. So there is something called white balance, and it's when the camera finds the whitest of whites and the blackest of blacks, and it pulls those colors, and it kind of makes your jewelry look weird colors. So I discovered a better way and a better bust to use. If you guys look at this one, this is in the gray, but you can, as long as it's a neutral color, so gray or brown work perfect. Tan, not brown, not dark brown, but like a lighter tan or this gray makes it look amazing. This is also a more sturdy one. You can actually hold it up. You can show your jewelry, show your jewelry, show your jewelry, and I love this so much. So I got mine at Michael's. And I did use my coupon. You can also get them on Amazon. Um, they are a little bit pricey, but if you use the coupon, it's not too bad, and they are definitely worth the money. So let me just show you guys how I would show this. Say I'm showing this gorgeous gold necklace. First of all, I would hold it up, and I would show the earrings, okay? And then I would also show probably the earring size. I might say this is on a double gold chain. It has these beautiful ovals that hang down that all come into a point here but let me show you this on the bust because then you can see how great it looks and how perfectly it lays okay so that is this one on the bust look how much better you guys look how much better it looks on this color and on this bust as opposed to that black one so pretty much I would have given up on the bust idea and I had just gotten rid of the black bust and not even used it so before I discovered this I would just be showing it like this Okay, and I might also show it like this, which I still sometimes do, but when you guys see it on here, you really see how perfectly it lays and how amazing this jewelry really looks. So stay with neutral colors, like I was saying, stick to like a tan or a gray, which brings out the color of the jewelry. Um, let's see, you guys should really come check me out. Um, and watch one of my live shows. You don't have to shop or buy anything, but then you can see me using this bust throughout the show. So say I'm gonna show this shorter necklace. This is just the silver necklace with the diamonds, and look how gorgeous that looks. Look how good you can see that necklace and all the cute detail in there, and how it lays on your neck when you wear it, as opposed to me just holding it up like that. I guarantee you're gonna sell more when they see it like this, and they see how it's going to look when you are actually wearing it but I would first I would show the earrings up close what they look like these are cute ones because they have that little diamond at the top and I would say they're medium and then I would show the necklace and then I would show it on the bust so it is really awesome thing to have I love it you can also do it with longer necklaces so this one is really pretty necklace in the green I would show the earrings these are kind of messed up they're supposed to be a little dangled but they're stuck in there but I would show the necklace tell about it say iridescent green beads, comes down into this longer silver layered look. And then I would, on this one, I would show what length it's gonna be, and I would probably say long, to medium to long. But then I would say, keep in mind that it's not going to look this short, of course, on the bust, but let me show you guys how it looks, if I can, um, how it would lay, well, there we go. I can't do this. Very good, but how it would, oh, there we go. How it would lay on the bust like that. So this is a longer one, and you have to practice a little bit, obviously, so that you know how you're doing it. But during a live, it's not like you can't say, oops, let me fix it so I can show you better. So it is worth the money. You can get them on Amazon, but I got mine at Michael's. Use a coupon. Um, I know sometimes a lot of their jewelry accessories are already like 50 to 40 to 50% off, and you can get any of that stuff for that price. But if not, you can always use a coupon. So um, stop by my live, come say hi, and see how it looks, and see how it works. And you can ask me any questions during it. I don't care. I love to interact with you guys. So it would be awesome 
for you guys to stop by. So remember, get rid of this old yucky black one that doesn't work good, that doesn't show the jewelry. Even when you're taking pictures for your albums, if you try to put it on here, you can see every single little white um, piece of lint on here. And it's not that it's dirty, it's just how it is. On this one, nothing. It looks perfectly new and perfectly clean. And I've had this for a long time. So it's not dirty, it's just perfect. So do that, try it, you guys will love it. It's a way to make your jewelry look amazing. Um, thank you guys for joining me. If you've watched before, thank you if you're new. I'm glad you joined me. Um, let me know in the comments if there's anything you guys want to learn about. I love feedback so I can um, teach you guys what you wanna do or what you wanna not do, but learn. I have tons of good ideas coming up. You guys are awesome, thank you for watching. I hope that you learned a good tip and I will talk to you guys later, bye.